There exists many hypotheses of what could happen once our life cycle ends. Yet not many people question what happens before we are born, or even before our fertilization. Theories that try to explain life before life ranges from another state of existence to total emptiness or non-existence. Today, we're going to take a look at five theories of existence before birth. Number five, another life. The idea of reincarnation is commonly found in various religions. It proposes that before our birth, we find ourselves living another life. That once that life cycle has ended, we are sent to a new life as a newly born baby. According to some people, babies can still remember their previous lives, but forgets it as it grows. It would be a bit confusing to wake up in a totally different place as a baby, especially if the last thing we remember is how we died. This hypothesis is actually one of the most accepted within human beliefs. Number 4. We Came From Heaven Another common belief among many religions, it affirms that humans are composed of body, spirit, and soul. A spirit is deposited within a newly born baby. Once it dies, it will return to heaven. According to this religious posture, what you are was really created millions of years ago, perhaps from a place where time does not exist. Yet the body has an expiration date, and the soul will return to the place from which it came from. Number 3. The Simulation or Video Game Theory A rather interesting hypothesis, but somewhat existentialist. This idea proposes that in reality, our world is nothing more than a simulation, or a video game if you will. That before we came into this world, we lived in the real world. But that this video game that we call life doesn't allow us to remember who we are or where we lived before. Thought-provoking, yet impossible to prove. Number 2. We are a part of a collective consciousness. A more recent ideal that has garnered much interest in recent decades and is a part of the hypothesis that there is a collective consciousness, an intelligence shared in the universe. That maybe the universe itself is self-aware, an intelligent being. It proposes that before we are born as humans, we are a part of this consciousness, but once we are born, we lose this connection. Some believe that if we could somehow reconnect to it, we may finally understand the mysteries of the universe. And number one, nature. Maybe asking where we were before we were born isn't the right question. From a naturalistic standpoint, there is no life before life. Our lives begin once fertilization occurs. We then develop and grow over time. Our personalities and desires are nothing more than chemical manifestations in our brains. All perception of reality begins once we leave the womb of our mothers and not before. We can't explain if anything existed before our birth since our lives really begin at that very moment. It is the only life we will have, so we must make the most of it. Tell me what you think. Which of these explanations do you believe to be the most plausible? Do you know of a different explanation? Is there life before life? Thank you all for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe. And remember, assume nothing and question everything.